Julian Gillardi, Grunt Baseball, and back with another Carlos Correa update. Just when you thought the Mets might be in the clear, doesn't look like that's going to be the case. There's another issue with his physical. Just like with the Giants, the Mets are worried about that lower right leg. Now, in 2014, when he was in the minors, he had surgery to repair a fracture in his right fibula. Now, this hasn't come up in his career, really, in the majors, but... He did have an issue in September with it, a slight one, but he didn't miss time. What happened was he ended up sliding into it or a ball hit him in that area where the plate was, and he said it felt weird for a while, but he was able to get through it and keep going, obviously. But with the Mets in this situation, what are they going to do? What's going to end up happening with Correa now? Can he go to another team? These are all valid questions. Now, Steve Cohen also may have made a mistake because he publicly talked about the deal which you aren't supposed to do until the physical is complete. And of course, it hasn't been complete again. And you have to wonder here, what's going on? The Twins did not want to give Correa a long-term deal last year, and they didn't have to do an extensive physical because it was a short-term deal. The Twins were ready to offer around 10 for 280 this time around. And then they tried to go back to the Twins when the Giants turned them down, but the Twins weren't moving up in the offer and the Mets were willing to go to the level they did, the 12 for 315. Now, Boris didn't want to wait around the Giants because he felt like the deal was good. And he thought there wasn't a physical issue. There was a lot of debate about that. But this is an absolute mess and nightmare. So what's the most likely outcome? In my opinion, I think that the Mets are going to end up getting him in a shorter term deal. But what that's going to look like exactly, at this point, who knows? Thank you for watching. If you like this content, subscribe to Grunt Baseball and happy holidays.